the bitches down like ever since the hands. I don't want petty money for my friends. Probably out there living, chilling with two pants in. Fucking beer now, but I'm not sure. Good Saturday morning to you, grandbabies. Excuse my big puppy ass, ugly ass wig. <laughs> but I just talked to one of my friends, me and her half. We was we was been friends for years and we had fell out for years. We haven't talked in years. And she called me yesterday. You know, she was telling me how good she's doing in life. And, you know, she's still been hurting me because she had lost her son. And then, you know, I um I was telling her about what I all my accomplishments in life. And then I also was telling her about what hurting me in life too. So today we we gonna start our friendship off fresh. But I told you guys, it's no more sweeping nothing under the rug for me. Not for me at all. So I'm, I'm all in for fixing stuff because all we have to do is apologize and grow. That's, that's what life about. You learn how to build relationship goals. You know what I'm saying? Friendships is relationship goals as well as with family. It's family relationship goals. You know, your husband, your guy, your friend, your boyfriend. You know, all that is good. You know, you got to learn how to be a friend. You got to learn how to love you. So when uh, bad things come, you can block it, block your energy, you know what I'm saying? Tell yourself that ain't really how this person act or that person act or that ain't how you should carry yourself, you know? So we getting older, you know, we in our 40s, 50s, I'm damn near 50, one year away from 50. That's living half of a century. So we got to just learn some type of communication, learn how to talk to one another, let each other know, like, that shit is on Cosper. Well, I ain't, I ain't tolerating certain certain madness. My God's around this since it's in the car. This Paris. But uh, we just want to go catch up. I hope it'll be a lot of laughs. And I'll take y'all along with us. Watch us try to be in this friendship. And see where do we go from here. Let's try to open up some businesses together you and your friends you know that'd be cute you and your girlfriends on the whole block that's that's goals so again excuse this fat egg fat weed and then then other try to put a closure on it still slide slide to the left slide to the right crisscross now slide back (laughs) (laughs) now freeze everybody hold your wig y'all in a minute <laughs> oh one more thing i always forget y'all i keep forgetting if this your first time stopping by my channel thank you thanks for stopping by the channel my name is tasha i call myself grandma and all and everybody is my grandbabies in order to be my grandbaby all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and guess what you my grandbaby too so Again, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit the notification button, so you can know every time I post a video, you will be notified first. As soon as it drops live, you will be the first one to watch it. And it's up from here. It's, life is gonna be litty. So I'm going. I got a hair appointment today. This this ain't our whole day. Oh, we ain't gonna spend our whole day like this. I don't know how to do no hair. But we ain't complaining over here. You remember that, right? All right. So let's get to this restaurant and let's go try to get this makeup. Still my birthday weekend. I forgot, y'all. Did y'all ever have a certain friend that when y'all get together, baby, y'all set the whole damn city down? This, that friend. We set a city down. We don't buy. I know we have so much fun. She says I'm her um I'm her also ego. You know how you get with certain people, you do certain certain crazy stuff, and some other people you just would not do certain stuff with. Me and her, we be doing crazy stuff together. But I'ma let her explain to you all her accomplishments that she accomplished the years, the couple of years we haven't been together. I think we haven't been together since 18. 
I think me and her haven't been friends in like four years. So I'm going to let her share with you her accomplishments. And then we'll, we'll find something to get in talk some ish. You know we're going to talk us some ish. And um, if she not for the YouTube getting on the camera, then it'll just be me. But uh, if she's if she's with sharing her victories and, um, with others, we here to listen and we here to cheer her on. So I just want to ask y'all, did y'all ever have that friend that when you get with this person, baby, it's, it's up and it's stuck. It's nothing but laughter, fun, just trying to figure out life, just going to all the who's who's and party. This a real nigga party, you cannot get in. Just, we, we just be lit. Okay, guys, I told y'all uh, I was going to see my friend, y'all. She got a whole BMW truck. She. Y'all, look at my friend. A bossy. Look at that booty, y'all. Boom, boom. Okay, friend, turn around, give me an outfit check. So. So, hey, grandbabies, this is Kamari, our server. He works at Love on the Blue. He's been there for a few years. He's 17 years old. He'll be graduating soon. In college, his major will be music and performance. Go, Kamari. We rooting for you. I hope you have a successful future. God bless you. Bye, Kamari. <laughs> Okay, grandbaby. So my friend, we left the restaurant. I'm finna go in this mall, see could I find a couple of pair of leggies. And then we gonna try to go get our hair did. What's our Okay, guys, we're here again. Finna get our hair. Yeah, you can have it. Look at all this stuff I got. In my okay, hair. Monday. Yes, Anita. How long you want? Rock on this, bro. But I ain't paying for this. Nah, you skint it, bro. I said keep it a little dark, but fade it. Hold on, keep it dark on the side. I mean, that ain't. Good Monday morning, baby. This is the beginning. I don't know. Now, this is not the beginning of a new vlog because I'm going to add you to another vlog when I went to be my girlfriend. But today we have another date. I'm on my way to plant. What, which one? I, I'm on my way to LA Fitness. To, as you all can see, I don't have on makeup. This is my second video ever without makeup. Not ever, but I really. I really, 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 really tired of wearing makeup. I want my beauty to come from within, that it come out. So whatever I put in, it, it shows in my features. But yeah, so we finna go work out a little bit. I'm glad to be doing something positive with my home girl. The other day, she really didn't feel like getting on camera. If she don't feel like it today, then you guys will just see me working out. But we on our way to LA Fitness. Hopefully, we have time to go in the steam room, the sauna. To steam out any sweat germs and things of that nature and um welcome to the middle of this vlog and if this is your first time uh clicking on my channel i want to first start out by saying i'm very grateful i hope you like it here if you do like it here my name is bossy tasha simon and 
my name is Tasha. You can call me Tasha or Grandma. Everybody that subscribes to my channel, I consider them as a grandchild. I don't care how old you is. You could be my grandmama's age, a great grandmama. You still a grandbaby to me because I think grandmas give out the best love. Um, they know how to nurture you. Let's go back to back in the days how grandmamas used to be having so many grandkids, 20, and then now one of them felt like grandmama ain't loved them out of all the 20. All 20 felt the exact same love. I want that kind of love. I want to spread the real kind of love, the old-fashioned love, the nurturing love. And, but lately, I see myself going in the direction of superficial. Not just because I got my body did. It's just like I want to be around only like the who's who and stuff like that. So I have to sit back and re reevaluate my life. That's not how God got me set up. I'm the person that throw the block parties. I'm the person that go feed the homeless. I'm the person that go feed the elders on my block. I'm. It's okay to be want to be the who's who's, but when you cancel out your sole purpose for being on earth. I also believe my sole purpose is, is, is kids and, and elderly. But when you cancel out your sole purpose on life, you keep going. I think you're going more, even if it do seem superficial, superficial and glamorous, when you stop being who you are designed to be, I think that's not pleasing. You know what I'm saying? So I have to just you know, back up off that thing and reevaluate life. And now I'm on the right path. And now I, I just really, really see blessings coming. And first of all, they wasn't coming through money. Because like I told y'all, on my own business, I, I haven't had a dollar in a while. So they wasn't coming with money. It was coming like peace of mind. Uh, getting to know yourself. Take yourself out. Uh, just different things. Just different things of that nature. And um, here we are. Finances is the back picked up. And I found myself, and I done reunited with a couple of my friends that I haven't spoke to in a while. So, God is good. And, oh, these are the braids, y'all. The last time I spoke to y'all, I was in an uh, African shop getting me some braids. I had on that little funny-looking wig that I tried to make myself. You know, everybody ain't that ain't, that ain't my gift. Cooking and wigs ain't my gift. I just, I, I think dressing, decorating houses and all that, that's, that's, that's up my alley. But I got these braids, and I think they look real cute. And that should keep keep maybe maybe it might help my edges to grow back for stops putting on wigs, taking them off. Just you know, if 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 I never get an edge again, you guys, I accept it now. But I want to say that you know them Africans, they don't be playing in them nail shots, baby. They ain't like no black mar black people to myself. Come already, watch me. Why you got a sink bowl in this motherfucker shop? If I can't get my hair washed, then you around here trying to buy some. You charge twenty dollars uh, 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 to keep your appointment. Okay, I understand that because people be having stuff coming up, or they just cancel their appointment, and then you already to say that slot for them. So that means you miss some money. But when the person arrives to their appointment, why they don't get their twenty dollars back added to their hair bill? Or when you late, why we don't get twenty dollars off? Make it make sense. So. I really felt good to get my hair washed and braided. And then them people, don't, them Africans ain't in there playing no games. They put two people on your head. I was in there four hours. They had told me six. And it turned around was four. They, they, boy, they get it did, baby. They get it did. I appreciate each and everything they did for me. Hey guys, as I came to the gym with my girl, I bumped into Eric Lane. Let him explain you how good of a person he is for Chicago. <laughs> What's good, y'all? How y'all doing? Out here working out, you know how we do. Uh, you might know me from my uh, trapped in the closet. I play Twan, but I'm starting a new TV series coming this September called Cold and Windy. Y'all gotta check it out. It's gonna be hot. You're gonna love it. It's coming from Chicago. It's done by some of the Chicagoans, Kenny Young and then Phil James. So you guys be watching out for cold and windy on WeTV. Peace. Peace. He love y'all and we love y'all. And y'all check out his um his TV show finna come out. We proud of him, baby. As a successful black man coming from Chicago. We hear so much bad stuff about Chicago. Everybody not bad in Chicago. There's some brilliant people here. But I'm at it with my bestie. Thank <laughs> y'all. These are workout goals. Hey. Now, let me tell you something. If he could get up here and go to the gym, we could go to the gym, too. What's your name? 
Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Say it again. Yeah, you're gonna be a celebrity, baby. You already a celebrity. So, how old are you, Joe? 98. Oh my God, y'all, Joe, 98. We love you, Joe. God bless you. So, what 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 did you do for a living? You was a teacher. God bless you, Joe. What grade? Okay, so we finna start this workout. But I don't want my my edge to show. We finna start this workout. <laughs> Me and my girl. So we got a smoothie, a breakfast smoothie. It got oats in there. Fiber. You can't see my ugly shoes. So let's get busy. We gonna get busy. She gonna do a. She gonna do a hundred of these. These like squat. These. Is these my belly? Okay, we got to do a hundred crunches. Wait, wait. Oh, this abdomen crunches. So look forward to my stomach being on flat, flat, where the zero in the way. Don't be mad. Don't be upset. Don't be jealous. Be like, that's my grandma. Don't forget to get up and do it too. Go to the gym and do it too. You and your girl. Okay, let me show you. My girl finna get started. She finna get started. And I'm finna get started. So let's go, babies. She moved out of state, she didn't want to left, she's seeking forgiveness. Hey guys, so me and China, we left the gym. We're at our other friend house and we're having African food. Let her tell you what we're having. <laughs> we got, we having fufu. Um, we're eating vegetable stew with a little okra. She's having white rice with vegetable stew and fish and the boiled egg. And China's eating the same thing as me. They don't got the fish or they don't got the eat. I'm trying to get the eat. So, I just was stopping by you guys to tell you that I'm in good, good company with good women and I'm not doing nothing to mess up my friendships. <laughs> so you don't do nothing to mess up your friendships because the way life is right now, we need good people in our life and you put out good energy as well. I love you. Hey guys, it's your grandmama here. It's okay to go to the library and get work did because sometimes you at home, you procrastinate if you anything like me. So I have to isolate myself from the world and get everything did. That's how I'm able to uh, own multiple businesses. And I'm just here to encourage anyone who's listening, please keep going. I don't care if you don't see any profit from your business now, keep going. I don't care if you don't see any money from getting up, going to work every day. I'm here to tell you to keep going. It's going to pay off eventually. God do not forsake his people. He see you trying to do right. Continue to do right. Be a blessing to your city. Be a blessing to your family and others. And keep going. And please keep God first in anything you do. And it will blossom like a flower. Okay, so I'm going to try the bicep curls. I got it on. That ain't heavy. Hey guys, this is Tasha Simon here. I'm just here to encourage you all, asking you all to never give up. Nothing about my man, I would never no. take their words oh, and yours. No. I'd rather let you yeah. make your promise. Oh no, no. you can't tell no, me can't. nothing about my man. He said you would step up, oh, said you was ready, no. but I should have listened. First one was a fuck up, second one was no one, third one was a come up, fourth one you said it be. Good morning, grandbabies. Good morning, grandbabies. Good Sunday, blessed morning to you. 
So today is Sunday, June the twelfth, and guess where me and Thomas is going? Church. <laughs> where we going? Tom? Church. Church. <laughs> so, uh oh. Okay, guys, so I have an encouraging word for you all today. And um, it goes like this. It's, I'm going to say, um, no matter what you do, if it's positive and you know you're not out here hurting no one to get to the bag or to get to the top, you ain't stepping on nobody's neck, you just standing on your ancestors, strong people, soldiers. Then continue to do it. I know sometimes it feel like the world on your shoulder. You feel like, man, this bill took my whole check. My kids took my whole check. This took my whole check. That took my whole check. My car note. Just different things. But keep going. I'm here to encourage you that, that it's going to pay off eventually. God never forsake his people. He never did and he never will. He ain't going to start with you. And he's not going to start with me. So his word do not come back void. So just keep going. Keep going. I just want you to keep going and never give up even when even when the eyes look stacked against you even when your family don't support you even if you were homeless i'd have been in a shelter before too no matter how low you get god squat down with you so my word for this sunday morning is to please keep going keep your faith strong everything's gonna get better the sun shines in the morning on that note god bless you be picking you back up when we make it to the church house. Good morning to you guys. Good Sunday morning. I'm going to do an outfit check. Braids, Africans, shirt, rainbow, chain. That is a belt. I wear it as a uh, chain. Gucci belt, the dupe store at, in Atlanta. Leggies, uh, Forest City Mall in the boutique. Shoes, H&M. Let's okay. go worship the Lord. I'm telling you, this church do not play, y'all. Welcome, welcome. I need to say. Oh, 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 we're drawn, we're drawn, we're drawn. Exodus 3 and 14, God said to Moses, this is what you're going to tell him. 
Introduce himself and tell you how good of a person he is for Chicago. So, how are you everybody doing? Uh, yesterday, we just had a gun turn in. I work for the Chicago Police Department at St. Elias Church. And we took over 400 guns off the street. So, I just want to thank all the citizens of Chicago, uh, St. Elias Church, and all the staff for helping out with the gun turn in. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. We thank you so much, Steve. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. And they tried to warn me Yeah, they tried to warn me You can't tell me nothing about my man I would never take their words and yours I'd rather let you make your promise Oh, no You can't tell me Nothing about my man he Said you would step up Said you was ready But I should have listened The first one was a fuck up Second one was no one Third one was a come up Fourth one you said It'd be different, different, different. And I believed you You never left me like you did them Holes on me like you did them I built you up And I held you down I built you up And I held you up Okay guys, so after church Me and Thomas came to Pearl's place It's a hotel On 39th in Michigan But they got a whole soul food restaurant in there And I'm on plate number two My first play was breakfast, second play lunch. I ain't gonna get them all. 
Okay, grandbabies, you gotta squeeze my lashes. I was at church crying. But I have two amazing men that's uh, sitting in Pearl's place having graphics. And I asked them could they get on my channel and they had no problem with it. She keep you busy, huh? <laughs> she looked in the beads, babe. Yeah, she do. <laughs> okay, guys, we have two Chicago finest. Let me hurry up and ask them before they start eating. Right, what's, your name? Okay. what's up, I'm Keith. What's up, Chi-Town? Hey, hey, Keith, what do you do for Chicago? And matter of fact, not what do you do for Chicago? What have you done with your life? So I was in the military, active duty, 23 years. Um, after that, I'm pretty much an entrepreneur, I'm best in real estate, and uh, I'm a fitness trainer as well. So I do a lot of high intensity exercise, coaching individual groups that sort of thing. You know, movement and mobility. That's my real house. What's your name, Keith? Keith. Keith, you're so amazing. I thank God for you. Continue so to be much. a great person for Chicago. You. Your light shines. When I see y'all down here, y'all gotta light that shine. Thank you so much. All right, and this is who he's in company with. You know you keep good company with the good people. Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Ike. Um, I'm in acquisitions for the federal government. Um, I'm also retired military, 20 years. Um, entrepreneur, real estate investor. I'm from Chicago. This is my hometown, and I love coming home every single time to experience what this city, what this city has to offer. Oh, that's amazing. I love you for that. Thank you so much. What's your name again? I, Ike. Yep. Thank you, Ike. Okay, guys, so I'm still in Pearl's place, and I bumped into a handsome man, and he's going to tell us how good of a man he is. He do the Lord's work, baby. Let's go, Tim. How y'all doing, Chicago? I'm just here visiting from New York. My daughters live right up the street, so I decided to come down here and get a great breakfast. I already ate here once. It was so nice, I had to try it twice. So I'm just checking in, letting y'all know I love Chicago. Peace, love, together. And where are you going today, Sam? I'm going to the old, good old White Sox game. Hey, yeah. yes, And I'm going to be sitting right on the field. Hey, Matthew! Boss! <laughs> I love you. Hey guys, so I stopped by the health food store since I left eating soul food and left church. And I just stopped by and I've met. Absolutely, Matt Jackson with the Coach Connection 360. She here, I'm here. This is a healthy place uh, and a place of happiness. And only thing that's missing is you. So come on down. 400 West 71st Street. We're open seven days of the week. Uh, and we also ship online. Again, people come here for all types of stuff. They come in for the sour socks here. They come in for black sea oils. And come on, let's go. We got over 21 different herbs, ashwagandha, elderberry, for all, no matter what you're going through, there's something here for you and it's all natural. Okay, so come on down. And this is his store here on 71st, what is this? 71st is store in Chicago. So don't forget to stop by you guys. This is a very nice store. And it's, is this black owned? It's black owned. It's community owned, guys. So, I'm not only just going to put my life in the Lord's hands, I'm going to change my life. I'm going to eat healthy. I'm going to walk with the Lord. I'm going to help the neighborhood. I'm going to be a blessing. And so do you guys. And everybody always talking about these, the stones. So here they even have the stones, guys. They have the candles. They have the crystals. So just only thing that's missing is you. So if you want to live a long, prosperous life, I think you're on the right path with what you put in. God bless you.